creative designs. Forty years ago this week, the crew of Apollo 8, Frank Borman, Jim Lovell, and Bill Anders became the first humans to visit another heavenly body when they successfully orbited the moon. Not only did their mission help lead the way to future landings on the moon, it also turned humankind's attention from a year of tragic world events to three men making a first-of-its-kind journey through the heavens. Anders photographed the Earth as never seen before. The most memorable thing for me was to see the Earth about as big as your fist at arm's length and realize that the Earth uh, is so tiny, you know, almost trivial as, you know, on the physical scale of things. Uh, I don't think that's sunk in in general to humanity. The Apollo 8 crew also made six live television transmissions during their mission on Christmas Eve as hundreds of millions of people watched their TVs back on Earth, the three astronauts took turns reading from the book of Genesis. In the beginning, God created the heaven and the Earth. And the Earth was without form and void, and darkness was upon the face of the deep. And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the waters. And God said, Let there be light. 